Hello, welcome to Hybis News. The nature of the cyber security threat from China, the working of the authoritarian regime in which the Communist Party, government and military as well as the world of business and academia are closely linked provide a unique advantage to the Beijing compared with democracies around the world. It was soon after the Gulf War of 1991 that the Chinese realized that the days of conventional warfare were rapidly coming to an end. Pavitran Ranjan, a former Indian Army officer and information warfare expert who was authored Engaging China, Indian Interest in the Information Age, says that Chinese understood that American technology was far ahead of them. They analyze that if they get into the ICT, that is information and communications technology, they could leapfrog a couple of generations and get ahead. This decision also coincided with the China turning into the electronics factory of the world. In 2003, the Central Committee of the Chinese Communist Party and China's Central Military Commission officially approved the concept of three warfares comprising psychological, media and legal warfare. It was then decided at the highest levels that the PLA should be an army ready to fight a war in the information domain by 2020. The PLA began to set up intelligence units dedicated to the cyber operations. In February 2013, the Alexandria, Virginia headquartered American cyber security firm Mandiant published a report that blew the lid of the Chinese cyber operations. APTI, e APT1 is a single organization of operations that has conducted a cyber espionage campaign against a broad range of victims since at least 2006. From our observations, it is one of the most prolific cyber espionage groups in the terms of sheer quantity of information stolen. According to the Mandiant report, APT1 has stolen billions of terabytes of data from 141 countries and companies across 20 major industries. APT1 said is believed to be the second bureau of the People's Liberation Army PLA General Staff Department's GST, third department which is most commonly known by its military unit cover designator MUCD as unit. For more news updates, please do watch Hibis News. This is Kranti Muddam signing off.